Dale, Jackson Lee Sales, Jackson, Mississippi, where we sell motorhomes, sell them only on eBay, and we sell a lot of them. Today we're going to list the most popular motorhome we deal with, folks. We rarely get one, and once in a while we do, we've got a nice one today. We have a Rialta, a Volkswagen Rialta, and it is a nice one. It is a 96, 70,000 miles on it. We drove it 200 miles home. Everything works. It's got the perfect full plan. We're going to show it to you. You hear the engine running? We're letting that do that, folks, because it's about 115 degrees here in the Confederacy. Today, it is unbearable, and we want to show you that it doesn't run hot and does nothing wrong. Come on, Dan, we'll show you. The tires are perfect. We're going to walk around it here, look inside. We've not cleaned it up, not done anything. No engine lights on. It's not running hot. 75,799 miles. All the blows, windows go up and down. I want you to look at this, folks. The paint is absolutely spectacular. I would assume, uh, as slick as it is, it may have been painted one time in its life. There's a little overspray here and there, but there's no body damage of any kind. Never has been. It's been perfect all its life. Come around here, how straight the sides are, the glass, everything. We've got it plugged up externally. You can see it, it's been used. We bought it from an elderly lady. I know that I say that kind of tongue in cheek because I'll be 67 in 10 days, but she was older than me, so I guess that makes her. Elderly, here's your power cord. There's a sewage hose in there too in the sewage bag. Sewage hose, yep. Uh, come around here, external. I mean, it's just everything the way it ought to be. Come on, step inside. Here's what I like about it. Is this floor plan? It has got the best floor plan. Oh, man. This air, it is ice cold in here. See the two beds? Now, this is a floor plan that all Rialtas ought to have. Instead of the bed that covers the whole back, this is what it ought to have. This is the right kind of floor plan. Look at the storage space the most convenient. These beds are comfortable, storage everywhere. You see Dan, show her son, it's never leaked. There's no water leaks anywhere. You could take that Any nightstand kind. out and put a probably a king size or RV king mattress yeah, back but there. You want to. This is more convenient. I mean I mean if you feel the need to feel warm and fuzzy, I mean you can and then you get back and be comfortable. Here's your shower, bathroom and shower. Everybody knows how these slide out. It comes right on out. The whole thing slides out and makes a shower. There's your commode down there. Really functional. See how immaculate it is? I'm gonna pull the floor I up mean, and do the shower. This thing is perfect. This is the shower. When that slides out, Dan's going to push that button. Slide it out. We'll pull it out here. See how it pulls out? Now, there you go. Got you a shower, folks. Voila. Pretty cool, huh? I think it's voila, not voila. Voila, voila. Well, actually, it shouldn't be any one. Both sound, sound like two. Anyway, I don't, it's V-O-I-L-A, it's voila. What did I say? What did you say? You said voila. Well, I did not. I said my son to law school, so now he thinks he's smarter than I am. Uh, not likely, but anyhow. Look at that table. There's TV hookups there. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I love the way they take these little old things and utilize every speck of space. I like this chair here. I like the double beds. Here's your refrigerator right here. Perfect. Got them some Arm & Hammer in there. Arm & Hammer, I got to do just about everything except fly the space shuttle. Here's your stove, immaculate. Everything works, see so your oven on, microwaves on. I'm telling you, this thing has got some cold air, folks. Dash am roof air. Dash air is ice cold. The roof air is ice cold. Now it has these, and... these rear vents run off of the engine. You can have AC or heat off the engine so you don't have to run the generator and they will cool the whole thing down. No, I didn't know that. 
unlike a regular motor home or a regular class B that's not ducted like that, you have to have your generator running if you're going down the road. This is putting out, it would literally, just the engine would, would cool the whole motor home. But you see it, folks, you see what it is. It's perfect. Uh, did you show up here, son? Oh, by the way, there is a little flying ointment. The windshield's cracked. I'm going to tell you right now, the windshield's cracked. We called in town. We are in Jackson, Mississippi, in the heart of the Confederacy. We are a taste behind in times. And we cannot find a windshield for this. Now, I'm sure if you live somewhere else, you can find one. We cannot. We are doing our best to find one. Uh, if we do, we will put a windshield in it. If not, we'll adjust our reserve accordingly. But the only thing I know you can pick this thing for is the windshield is cracked. I what are these? They look like shower curtains, I guess. I guess that's what they are. Uh, it's got a furnace, warns off propane, as well as the electric up front. Got an electric hot water heater right there. Man, I hate to get out. I hate to end this video because I've got to get back outside, but I will. We're going to list this tonight, folks. You can look at our feedback. See, we've sold hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of motorhomes. When I tell you we're going to sell it, we're going to sell it. Uh, we're going to list it tonight. It will have, an, it will have a, a good reserve. This is the motorhome that everyone seems to want. It's so popular and so handy. We drove it 200 miles home without any issue. My son drove it, so you know it has no issues. Had I been driving it, there might have been some issue because I would have drove it reasonably 65 miles an hour, but I'm sure he drove 80. But anyway, no issues, 200 miles home. You saw the outside, the air's ice cold, the refrigerator's on, everything's on. The generator's been tuned up. It's immaculate, the generator's been tuned up. Uh, just everything works. Only 70 some thousand miles on it, it's a 96. It's just about perfect. It has a great full plan. Great powertrain is still sitting here running. You see, it's doing nothing wrong. If you're wanting to buy a Rialto, or you're thinking about buying a Rialto, you need to look at this one real closely, folks. I wouldn't hesitate to start it. We're in the country in it. We're going to list it tonight. We're going to sell it. If you have a question about it, give me a call. My name is Bob Dale, 601 218 1223. 601 218 1223. If you have a question about it, as I say, if you want to make an offer, if you want to try to buy it, or if you just want to shoot the breeze, give me a call. Answer my phone all the time. I like to visit. We appreciate you bidding on our stuff, folks. We appreciate your business. We look forward to seeing you in person. Thank you.